So if we really ever needed to talk about something positive and uplifting, it is right now and mm -hmm. this week. We can count on our next guest to always bring us a positive spin to any conversation. Yeah, so please welcome back to the show Ernie Anastas, host of Positively America uh -huh. with Ernie Anastas, which <laughs> is go. right here good on Pixel. Good to see you guys. Yes, we do need positivity. Yeah. Yeah, you know, and, and there you. are a lot of good things we can talk about. I mean, this week on the show, uh, I'm interviewing Gary Sinise. What a great actor. I mean, you remember him, Lieutenant Dan? Forrest yeah. Gump, yeah. You know, when he was in Forrest Gump? Mm -hmm. uh, you know, it changed his life. He, he decided that he wanted to really help veterans uh, and first responders. He created a foundation. So he goes out there, he entertains, he performs, but he raises money to help build communities and help these people. I, I think he's really committed to this thing, and you can see it when he's talking about it. I love his passion. Yeah. Yeah. And I, so to, he also is working on this positive project. Is that what you're speaking yeah, of? Yeah. You know, I, I think the importance important thing is that, you know, when you're committed to something, like he said, this is my mission. I mean, it changed. He, he never wore the uniform. Right. No. But no, but but he was an honorary Marine. Yeah. He's very proud of that. So he feels that, you know, he's doing something to help people to uh, understand that veterans have given so much yeah. and they need help with their health their family and building their communities and he's doing just that yeah. which is yeah. great it's great. so important it's so amazing when you get involved with something even as simple as acting in a movie like that right? yeah. you you yeah. take on this project yeah um, I, I worked with a special needs organization as a teenager which kind of like led to this whole other path of making sure that folks who have special needs are really looked at like everybody else yeah. in the world yeah. it's just amazing I want to talk to you also sure. about how travel Big time travel can make a difference in a, in a kiddo's life. <laughs> Listen, you, you, you got children, you understand what yes, it's like. Yes, sir. And, and it's a story, I'm talking to an expert about travel and how kids can really expand their whole world. I mean, it's common sense. They go somewhere, they see what it's like, they learn about culture, uh, they understand more about what's going on. And later in life, uh, it expands their idea of being able to understand other people's opinions and viewpoints. Yeah. Diversity, how much can we say about that? Kids learn a lot about that. And you know what? Bilingual. Yeah. Very important. I did an interview on that. Uh, when you start thinking about children learning another language, do you realize the benefits of doing that? She just of course. Cognitive yeah. skills, ab absolutely. I mean, they're able to be able to understand a little bit more about what's going on in different cultures, but they become better citizens. Yeah, well, it's all about inclusivity and mm. feeling like you're a part of a community. Yeah, they become part of the community. They understand they mm -hmm. can solve problems better. Uh, and I think that when you understand the whole travel scheme, I know people worry about travel these days, but it's okay. Mm -hmm. uh, most important thing, you do it with your family, right? right. You, you like to travel with of kids? Of course. Do they come back and say, hey, I learned something new, and they start speaking a different language, maybe, or a well, couple Well, we've not gone that far yet. But. <laughs> I'm trying to get her to speak the, <laughs> a couple of words first. She's a little too young. But, yeah, I mean, hopefully that's the idea eventually. Yeah, yeah. and I think all of the programs, you know, that we're doing really focus on lifestyle, mm -hmm. family, and relationships, and finding solutions to problems. So I'm going to say right. to you with different languages, uh, buenos noches, buenos dias. Buenos dias. Calimera, uh, mm -hmm. buongiorno, there right? Como está acá? That's in I like that very yeah, much. Yeah. Good go. seeing very you guys nice. always. Always good Thanks. to see you, Ernie. Thanks. Looking Thanks. forward to this week's show, okay? And you can tune in and catch Positively America with Ernie and Estes right here on PIX11 Sunday morning at 6 o'clock. Very good. We need it, especially after a week like this.